Welcome to day two in Liverpool, at the end of day two at the Labour Party conference, a day which began well for the Chancellor Rachel Reeves because she saw me at about 6.30 in the morning when we exchanged a cheery hello. Um, she then gave her speech later on, which, uh, in which she was a bit happier, a bit smilier, trying to be a little bit more optimistic. But there was one particular piece that stood out because I thought, here we go, the South West is going to get a mention. It went like this. Jobs in the automotive sector of the future in the West Midlands. Jobs in life sciences across the North West. Clean technology across South Yorkshire. A thriving gaming industry in Dundee. And jobs in carbon capture and storage on Teesside, Humberside and Merseyside. Now each of those could in theory have mentioned the South West, but they didn't. And this is a real problem. We're not even getting lip service at the moment. And we probably have until October the 30th and the, and the budget to really start uh, making a bit of a noise about this and a noise about ourselves and to try and work out why, even when there's opportunities to mention the Southwest, it doesn't come across the speech. And that's really been my main takeaway for the day. Um, pensions were discussed again today. A bit more on that tomorrow, a couple of startup coalition events. Um, but that's the main takeaway from today. How do we get the Chancellor, how do we get this new Labour government really thinking about the Southwest? as someone to showcase their industrial strategy, their National Wealth Fund, GB Energy. That's the challenge for the coming weeks and months.